video version of what's taking place at Sacred Heart School. Current and past broadcasts can be found at our YouTube channel, Sacred Heart School Omaha. Broadcasts are posted every weekend. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. Catholic Schools Week was a blast. Here is a review of the activities that took place. Sacred Heart students, where are you most likely to run into Mr. Jensen on the weekend? Neil, you're going to start us off. Walmart. Walmart. Mm, I love to go to Walmart. Let's see if Mr. Jensen goes too. For Black History Month this week, we'd like to recognize people past and present who have done great things in history. This week, we are recognizing a local black history hero, Simone Sanders. Simone Sanders served as a national press secretary for Democratic presidential candidate Bernie Sanders during his 2016 presidential campaign. Following there, she worked at CNN as a Democratic strategist and political commentator. In April 2019, Sanders became a senior advisor of the 2020 presidential campaign of former Vice President Joe Biden. Upon President Biden's win, Ms. Sanders was named chief spokesperson and a senior advisor for Vice President Kamala Harris. Ms. Sanders is also one of our own as she graduated from Sacred Heart School, proving that anything is possible for us as long as we believe at Sacred Heart. It's that time where we find out what's for lunch with Dion. Hey, this is Dion answering your burning question. What's for lunch? On Monday, we'll have sausage and cheese biscuits, glazed carrots, grape tomatoes, and blueberries. On Tuesday, we'll have chicken fried chicken with gravy and bread, mashed potatoes and gravy, grape tomatoes, and bananas. On Wednesday, we'll have hot dog on a bun, cowboy beans, grape tomatoes, and chilled peaches. On Thursday, we'll have chili mac with noodles and bread, romaine salad, kryptons, grape tomatoes, and chilled pears. Back to you. Thanks, Dion. And now for a segment of the pod called Read to Me where students or staff give recommendations on books that they've read and loved. Hello, Sacred Heart School. I'm back with another wonderful suggestion for a book for the month of February because of it's Black History Month. And I think all of you are aware that Jackie Robinson, number 42 with the Brooklyn Dodgers, was a great baseball player who broke the color barrier when he first started playing with the Brooklyn Dodgers. Well, I'm not here to talk about this book. I'm here to talk about one of America's greatest pastimes, which is baseball, and this book called We Are the Ship, the story of Negro League Baseball. His words and paintings are by Kadir Nelson. This book has a lot of personal meaning for me because my father, way before I was born, was part of the Negro League Baseball. 
There are beautiful paintings in here that look like photographs that Kadir Nelson did. And one of them in the very beginning of the book is Hank Aaron. And he just passed away, unfortunately, in January of this year. He <coughs> was a great baseball player and he speaks at the very beginning, there's a page of him talking about his perspective on the Negro League baseball team. One of the things that I really want you to take away from reading this book is that these men, these young men, and many of them were, fa were family members. My father and two of his brothers played on the, a team from Sioux City, Iowa. That's where I grew up. And a lot of, a lot of teams had family members on them. And they played because they loved the sport of baseball. And even though they weren't able to play in a major league, uh, on a major league team until after Jackie Robinson. And they weren't paid much, but they did it because of their love of the game. And so I just, I want you to realize that there is a history, a past that African Americans should be proud of and the people that are playing on the teams today, everyone should be aware of the Negro League baseball teams that existed all throughout the United States. If you have a book that you'd like to share, please submit your request to your teacher. That's it for the pause this week. Thank you for joining us. See you next week.